a very good afternoon my name is alok shrivastava and i welcome you once again to do these small videos given to you by network nuts first of all i like to say sorry for being hibernated for so long uh, so i'm just back here with with a bang and uh, here's a small video that tells you how to log user activity using process accounting now what's the idea is the idea is that being an administrator i should be able to see a detailed log of every each and every command given or run by a user on my server though you have normal log files like var log message var log secure but those don't give you the ability to view the commands executed by the users so by using the process accounting i can view the commands actual commands those are being hit by the users so it will help you like gathering more information that what which user is executing what command and at what time so that can be done using the process accounting so let's see how to do it so for this video i have a virtual server here for you here it, it is it's running rel 5.4 just show you this so i'm here with the uh, rel 5.4 so now to activate the process accounting what you need to do you just need to create a file i'll just clear it you first create a file you can use the touch command var account pact process accounting you create the file and then just change the permission to 660 var account p a c c t that's great so first create a file under var account p a c c t the file name will be p a c c t and then change the permission make sure that you have the account directory or the folder already there under the var if the folder is not there please create this folder if it is not there in my machine it is there that's great now what to do nothing job is done just restart the service process account restart and do a check config pa acct on obviously so my process accounting has been started successfully that's great what next how to check good a very good question now i have a user here alok i'll just show you i do a tail here it is a user here alok now what is going on i go back to my base machine Vroom, go back. It's a different machine. Here, I log on with the name Alok to my virtual server. The virtual server IP is two five three. Fine. So I'm trying to hit my machine on which the process accounting has been activated. I hit here. I give the password. Great. I will not tell you the password. Okay. Now I am on the word server. Now I'm giving some commands. Say I give finger. I execute say slash as bin f disk hyphen l though it will not be executed as I don't have the rights. I give who. That's great. Now I go back again on the machine. How to check it out? Now you've got a couple of commands. With those commands, you can check what has been done by which user. First command is the ac command. It's very simple. Account. That is the total. connect time you can give ac hyphen p to give you a like a slightly more in information that alok is is being logged on on this machine which i am for the last 4 minutes or whatever that's great now how to check the commands very simple there is a command there last com last command and then give the username you want to keep a tab in this example i am trying to check what command has has been executed by alok i give enter wow that's great if you if if i just go here i'll show you here it is who is coming up avdis is coming up finger is coming up so these commands are being executed by alok and the date and time are coming up so that is a really very important and a relevant information for any administrator you can also search for commands also like last com say f disk so you will 
we uh, like getting the uh, the information that fdis commands are is being executed by whom and by what at what time that's great you can also give the terminal also pts2 those commands are executed on a particular terminal here i am pointing at the terminal so this process accounting though it's a very small thing but uh, we never configure it i'd like seen uh, many of the like persons or the companies they never configure the process accounting though it's a very small thing so these are uh, like the small tips uh, to configure your process accounting then we have got a one more command you give sa it gives you all the commands executed on your machine all the commands look here all the command and these are the number of hits how many times i had executed last com for four times wow that's great so this is the benefit of configuring process accounting on your machine i hope you like this video thank you very much and one more thing you can access our uh, facebook by giving simple www.facebook.com/networknuts so thank you once again thank you very much god bless see you again soon